Good evening, YouTubers. New Thai Travel High Me 88 here. I'm back with a brand new video. And tonight, I'm going to show you guys my VHS and DVD that I picked up as of August 4th, 2015. It's a VHS DVD update. I went to a store, Salvation Army Thrift Store in Baltimore, Maryland. And that's where near... Not too far from St. Agnes Hospital. So, anyway, I got one clamshell tapes, six VHS slip covers, and two DVDs. And they are on sale. 25% off, good discount. Is that a good bargain or what? So, anyway, let's get right on to the, the showing of the tapes. Okay, let's start off with the clamshell tape. And the first VHS tape that I picked up is a 2000 VHS of An American Tale, The Mysteries of the Night Monster. Now, I haven't seen Volume 4 of An American Tale, but I've only seen An American Tale and American Tale 2, Five of Goes West. Plus, I've seen bits and pieces of An American Tale, The Treasures of Manhattan Island. But this... It's a new full length adventure. It's like a direct to video sequel. I'm going to have to watch this video one day this week to see how much I like this film. So, anyway, here's the front, the spine, and the back. And let me pull out the tape and show you guys the VHS tape of An American Tale The Mysteries of the Night Monster with the sticker label and the print date. Actually, it's the snow print date. And this is printed on the 30th week of 2000. And that's the 2000 VHS of American Tale, The Mysteries of the Night Monster. All right, next up, move on to the uh, slip case. The next VHS tape that I got is a 1990 VHS of The Coal Miner's Daughter. Now, I've only seen clips of the movie when they showing it on the, the Universal story. It's a true story of Loretta Lynn. And Sissy Spacek did a wonderful job performing as Loretta Lynn. It also stars Tommy Lee Jones. So anyway, here's the front, the spine, the other spine, the top, and the back. And here's the tape for the coal miner's daughter with the sticker label. No print date. This is printed on the 26th week of 1990. I'm going to check the tape to see where it's got the MCA home video or the MCA universal home video opening. So that's a 1990 VHS of the coal miner's daughter. Next VHS tape that I got is a 1988 VHS of The Untouchables. Now, I only saw this movie one time at my aunt's house. And this is a great movie. It's based off of a TV series that was basically on the 1950 television series. It stars Kevin Costner, Sean Connery, and Robert De Niro. So anyway, here's the front, the spine, the other spine, the top, and the back. And here's the tape of the Untouchables with the sticker label and label. This is printed on the 14th week of 1988. So, that's the 1988 VHS of The Untouchables. Alright. Next up, VHS I got here is a 1990 VHS of Ghost. Now, this is a 
great uh, movie. I saw this movie three times on cable. Start the late Patrick Swayze as the guy who's killed off and brought back as a, a spiritual for the ghost. And it also stars Demi Moore and Whoopi Goldberg. So here's the front, the spine, the other spine, the top, and the back. And here's a tape of Ghost with a nice silver tape with the sticker label and end label. And that's the 1990 VHS of Ghost. Next tape I have here is a 1990 VHS of Rocky 3. Yes, Rocky 3 is a sequel to the 1976 film Rocky and takes off when Rocky 2 left off and this time meet a newcomer to challenge Rocky Balboa is Mr. T as Cubber Lang. His opponent Mr. Apollo Creed helps Rocky to beat this chump. So anyway here's the front, the spine, the other spine, the top and the back. I just got a new copy. And here's the tape of Rocky 3 with the sticker label. And the print date is May 6, 1995. And this tape used the Tape Masters from 1990. And that's the 1990 VHS of Rocky 3. Also, the next tape I also got is a also a 1990 VHS of Rocky 4. Now, even though Rocky 4 didn't make it to the box office because it got little uh, mixed reviews by the critics, Rocky 4 is a great film. I really enjoy it. It's probably one of the least favorites of the Rocky series. And this time, um, Dot Lundgren plays Ivan Drago. So I really love the Rocky series. But anyway, here's the front, the spine, the other spine, the top, and the back. I also own the 1986 CBS Fox video release of Rocky IV. So anyway, here's the tape for Rocky IV. With the sticker label and the print date is April 16th 1995 and yes this tape does have a trailer for Rocky 5 so is Rocky 3 I have yet to get Rocky and Rocky 2 on VHS but I do plan to get that one soon so anyway that's the 1990 VHS of Rocky 4 and the last Rocky tape that I'm going to show you guys is a 1991 VHS of Rocky 5. Rocky 5 is a box office failure and even though Rocky is retired he's suffered brain trauma and this time they want a professional George Washington Duke and wants Italian Stallion to go back to beat up again but unfortunately Rocky's broke. He's going back to Philadelphia. And this time, he is trained with this new guy, played by the late Tommy Morrison. S. Yep. Anyway, here's the front. The spine. Other spine. The top. And the back. So anyway, this has never been open. And that's the 1991 VHS of Rocky V. Alright, on to the DVDs. The next DVD that I got is a 2000 VHS of Arachnophobia. Arachnophobia is a kind of a scary movie, but I really saw this movie. I've seen it two times on cable. 
It is scary to me. And Siskel and Eber gave it two thumbs up. So here's the front, a spine, and the back. And here's what the DVD looked like. Alright, that's the 2000 VHS of Arachnophobia. The last DVD I'm going to show you guys, which is the Red Green Show. <laughs> I really love Red Green because this is a hilarious show and I really saw Red Green. It was on PBS, but sadly it was taken off the schedule with 17 episodes. And remember, it's trademark. If women don't find you handsome, they should at least find their handy. Here's the front, the spine, and the, and the back. I'm collecting red green. So I do plan to get more of these red green DVDs to show off in my collection. Alright guys, that's it for my VHS and DVD pickup. Remember, like this video and give it a thumbs up. Alright guys, new time travel behind me, 88. Stay in school, be a thinker, dream big, don't quit, and remember, get a good grade. Good night, and have a pleasant tomorrow.